What's up, guys? Yeah, welcome back. This is IK.com. We thank God that uh, everybody is uh, singing one uh, song, which means disbursement is near. Disbursement is near. All the V note says disbursement is near. We thank God for that uh, synchronization in everybody's V note. So we pray that uh, some people say this week, some people say this month. But the bottom line is that disbursement is near and is not far fetched and is uh, sacrosanct, if not this week, this month. So just listen to this V note. Just listen to this V note. Drop your comment in the description below. We just pray, everybody. Let us pray. Let us pray that this month should be the month of celebration. Listen to this V note. See you at the end of the video. And uh, fellow subscribers to the UAAG grant, uh, we are talking about. I deem it right to come out to make some statements that are confusing and distracting to anybody that hates confusion. We have been told in this grant that the UAAG spokesperson, uh, Comrade OCG, is the right person that we will listen to or the country director, Apostle Ken Wakama. On the other way around also, we listen to uh, AGPGN, especially the spokesperson, Osade Wu, and the president, Abdul the German machine. So it confuses me when some people come out to make some statements unwarranted and unauthorized, not knowing that what they are saying is just a bunch of confusion to people that hear them. Because people cannot understand what they are saying. This evening, I happened to listen to one voice note from Engineer Henry, who is narrating the bundles and the number of uh, subscribers in a bundle and how NGOs will be given bundle and how much that should be given to different kinds of beneficiaries. As if he is the spokesperson that has come out to tell the Nigerians on what to do. When UAAG said that they have nothing to do with bundle heads, they are only after NGOs. What they said or the meaning of their statement is this. It is not that the Bundle heads will be denied because they are the propeller of the grant ecosystem you are talking about. Remove the bundle heads, nothing is happening. So the UAAG is not saying, in my best understanding of the hotel, which is supposed to be, that the bundle heads are forgotten or denied. No. What they mean is this. Everything about the bundle heads and everything about the subscribers will be handed over to the NGOs to handle. They will not handle these categories of subscribers directly from the uh, UAAG uh, account or platform. But they will hand them over to the NGOs who now in turn handle the 
bundle heads and the subscribers. So if anyone is coming out to say that uh, UAAG has nothing to do with the bundle heads, that person does not understand what he's saying. Without the, hundred, the bundle heads, there is nothing like organized grant system. These are the frontiers. These are the laborers. They can never be forgotten. And the Wagama himself, Apostle Wagama, had already come out to say that. Ustaz Dewu had come out to say that. German uh, machine has come out to say that. So they are not saying that the body heads are thrown away. NGOs and the grant handlers or, or, or grant uh, uh, coordinators can do nothing without the bond heads. So what that means is that the bond heads issue or payment will be carried out after being empowered from the national body, which is UAAG, to the NGOs. So let us understand it very straight. Then that issue of a sponsor or no sponsor is limited to uh, 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 an NGO strategy. So it doesn't count much. When the payment is being carried out, every NGO knows its own style of operation but whatever they will give to the boundary heads or, or subscribers must come from the central body this time uaag so let us not be confusing people or telling people as if we are bringing another uh, law or another mode of operation so please every voice note that is not geared towards encouraging people's heart or making people to be happy should be avoided this time around. Let us actually see what God is about to do in this grand colony. And the way I'm seeing it, so many people called CEOs, like the man I had his voice, should be educated, should be taught should be made to understand the clarification must come from the central, that's UAAG, to the CEOs of NGOs on what to do. Let nobody just do his own mind. A bundle is a bundle of 1,000 names. A bundle is never 700. A bundle is never 500. Neither is it 1,200. A bundle is 1,000. And then some subscribers receiving uh, not up to one million, and some receiving one million. Which system be that one? Which class? What what talk is that one? Let us wait for Apostle Ken Wakaman and the AGPGN to come up with the reality of things in their broadcast. Let us never be sh faster than our shadow or talk things that will bring confusion and distraction to people. Let us allow them. After finishing the whole thing, they'll make broadcast or direction on what to do. At that point, everybody knows what belongs to him or her. It's not on personal issues or ideology, which may be misleading. Our prayer now is that AGPGN and uh, uh, UAAG will actually reconcile and make this move forward. Every other direction will come, whether it is one bundle to every NGO or 10 bundles to every NGO, let us hear from them. Let nobody come up with this unnecessary tensional statement of one bundle to bundle. You are not a UAG spokesperson. Neither are you the country director Neither are you from the AGPGN. So, please allow them 
to say their mind. Let there be no more noise. Let there be no more confusion. Let there be no more distraction in this thing that is happening. Nigerian system is always noisy. Everybody will just stand up and begin to say, uh, talk the thing that is in his own mind. Not minding the implication or the consequence of what he or she is saying, which is wrong. So please, I advise everybody in this platform not to listen to any type of voice note from anybody. Let us wait for the broadcast of uh, the country director, Apostle Ken Nwakama, and his AGPG and counterpart. And I believe that God, who has seen the affliction of people and the cries of people, will definitely make it a peaceful disbursement. No more war and no more creation of war. No more confusion and no more cre cre creation of uh, confusion. Let everything work peacefully and God shall receive the glory. Thank you once again. This is the voice of evangelist Okoro Michael saying bye to everyone. May the Lord give us peaceful disbursement come next week or any time that time. To him be the glory. Good night and bye-bye.